Hey guys, what's going on? So today we're going to be showing you how to do a quick uh, install and a nice easy upgrade for your AR15 platform. Um, now this upgrade works across all platforms, so the AR9, the AR15, the AR10, and the AR180. Uh, it's all going to be the same exact install. It's super simple and it's going to take you guys probably about maybe 10 minutes to do. Um, so today we're going to be discussing how to install a safety selector. And this is, um, you can use it if you want a new safety selector, if you're building a rifle and you're installing your first safety selector, or if you're changing out your existing safety selector for something like the Radian Talon, which is an ambidextrous selector that has a 90 throw or a short 45 throw. This particular, um, this particular version has a long selector and a short selector. So the only thing you need for this is the tool they give you for their detent and spring and you need an allen key to take off the pistol grip and then everything else is extremely simple and we'll get to the bird's eye view. We'll give you guys a, a view down so we can show you guys step by step of exactly how we're going to go about changing out the stock safety on this lower receiver to the ambidextrous radian talon selector. So to change out the safety selector on your lower receiver, the first thing you need is a 3 16 Allen and a driver of some type. First thing is you're gonna get to the bottom of your um, pistol grip here by simply removing anything inside stored in the grip or you may already have an open case anyways. Now deep down inside there is going to be a um, little allen key and you're just going to take your driver reach on in there and break it loose be sure to hold the grip uh, there is a spring and a detent for the safety and you don't want to lose that so once you get that all the way loosened take it off and here is the spring that is going to actually hold the detent into the notch and the safety selector. Set that aside so you don't lose it. Bring this over. Take out the detent that goes into the safety, into this little tiny hole right here. And your safety will just come right out. So here's your stock safety. Next, we're going to open up our package from Radian, which is going to have our two levers and a spring combo detent that they provide and a tool. They're also going to provide a new spring and a new detent for the safety that works better. You want to use these over the stock ones. Set this stuff aside. And the Radian's talons use a dovetail system. As you can see here, there's a dovetail here, and it's going to slide right in like so and then that spring detent that they give you holds it in place so we're gonna put the longer one on our fire side we're gonna slide that in uh, here you can see the different um, 45 or the 90 selector the 45 is gonna be the shorter one which is what I like to use so we're gonna set this particular one up in the 45 position which is gonna be like so so you drop her in, make sure you hold it here, you're going to take your new stuff, you should probably dump this out on the table before you have it, we're going to take our new detent first, drop that in the hole, we're going to take our new spring, and that's going to go in our pistol grip, just like this, and then you want to make sure that when you push this down, you want to make sure that it captures and doesn't wrinkle or pinch the spring. So then you simply take your driver and without cross threading it, you want to send this home. Put it on nice and snug for now because you are going to go back, tighten everything up at the same time. So you want to make sure it works. And then once it works, you can go ahead and start actually installing the individual safety levers. So for this one, we're going to take it and you take your little spring that Radian gives you with the detent for their selector, put it in the hole and you take the tool that Radian gives you, which is just a little punch. You're going to start that dovetail. And here's where you want to make sure that these don't pop out because you will send them flying. Push the detent down and simply slide the lever forward. And there you go. That's the short side installed. 
Now we'll go over to the long side, and we're going to do the same thing. So we're going to pull this back. Again, we're going to take our detent and spring, pop it in there. We're going to start it by getting it over the half lip. And then we're going to take our tool, push the detent down, and simply again slide it forward. And there you go. You'll hear it snap back in with an audible snap. And to remove these, you simply do the same thing backwards. So you're going to stick the thing through the hole, push it down, and pull it out. Once you do this, you're going to want to go ahead and do a function test. So we have it on save now. Doesn't fire. Put it to fire. Send it out. Trigger works. Lock it. Doesn't fire. Fire. Perfect. And there you go. And that is how you install the Radian Talon Safety Selector. And just like that, after about five minute install, you have a perfectly functioning safety upgrade to your AR platform. Again, that's the Radian Talon. And I think it's an excellent upgrade. It gives you a much better feel and a very audible click on the safety selection. You do get ambidextrous, which is nice. You can flick it off with your off finger or your trigger finger, and you do have a way to change lever lengths, sizes, etc. And um, you can change out the color if you'd like. So if you guys like the video, click the link down below, subscribe, and leave a comment if you do.